In this video, we'll introduce you to the basic operations and app control when using the Olight Oboe Pro for the first time. For your first use, please fully charge the Oboe Pro using the MCC 1A charging cable. The on-off button can be operated by pressing the flat part of the bottom or by pressing the top of the cover if the product sits securely on a hard surface. To lock the product while the light is off, press and hold the button for two seconds until the white light briefly turns on and off again. To unlock, press and hold the button for one second until the white light flashes once to unlock it. Before beginning, please download the Olight app on your mobile phone. Enable the Bluetooth and GPS functions on your mobile phone and launch the Olight app while the Obol Pro is turned on with the white light setting. Press and hold its button for five seconds until it flashes red and then green to enter the network setting mode. Tap Add New Device to search for a new Olight device. Tick the MAC address of the Obol Pro and tap OK to add it. After it is added, the Obol Pro will appear in the My Device list. Users can turn it on and off by tapping the control slider or access the control panel by tapping the device entry. The cycle order is as following. White light, red, green, blue. Fade between colors. Cycle between colors. Flashing red and off. Tap more to enter the color wheel. With the color tab, the control panel allows users to customize colors with a color wheel. Adjust brightness levels and turn the Obol Pro off. You can also see the battery life and the remaining runtime. After the Olight devices have been grouped, tap the icon in the upper right hand corner of the My Device page and select Groups to access group control. Edit the group name by tapping it. Users can edit the name and picture of a device in the control panel. Customize the name and picture of the device by tapping the corresponding area. Tap Kick Out to delete the device from the Bluetooth mesh network. Tap the plus icon in the upper right corner of the control panel to enter the select group page. Tick the relevant group number to add the Obol Pro to that group. In the device list, you can delete devices from the Bluetooth mesh network. Long press on any device entry. Tick the relevant device and tap delete. If you need to add multiple Obol Pros to your setup, be sure to activate network setting mode. Tap add new device to search for a new Olight device. Tick the MAC address of the Obol Pro and tap OK to add it. Once the devices have been successfully added, add them to the specific group of your choice. The Olight app allows users to share multiple devices in a mesh network to another mobile phone. This allows the other phone to control the device by simply scanning a generated QR code. Tap the icon in the upper right corner and select Share. Tap Export then tap Generate QR Code. From a different device, tap Import, tap Scan QR Code, and scan the QR code to import. To check out this product and many more like it, visit us at olightstore.com. Thank you for choosing Olight.